by clicking the little arrow there, you're going to be able to switch between the three default workspaces, drafting and annotation, which is the current and default one you're probably used to. This is perfect for generic 2D drafting and drawing, but it's not really customized for any specific industry. But the next one that's available is 3D Basics, and this is going to change up the display of your ribbon primarily, uh, giving you the 3D modeling tools. So if you're interested or using 3D modeling within AutoCAD, you're probably going to be starting with this workspace. Uh, and then if you hit the arrow once more down here, you can go into the full 3D modeling option. And this is going to have more options when it comes to uh, 3D modeling, including like separating and extruding faces and a little bit more customization and tweaking when it comes to mesh, mesh and surface tools. It's going to be how to create your own and how to customize what's available to 